The share market has been on a round trip to nowhere for the past month and a half, hostage to the daily news out of Ukraine, the commodity price greens and speculation about what the US central bank might do about inflation. Today the market went up because of strong buying of banks and blue chip industrials like CSL and Telstra, while mining stocks went backwards. The New York market fell more than 1% on Friday, as did Shanghai today, but Tokyo stocks went up. On commodity markets, oil fell a couple of percent, iron ore 3%, palladium 5%, and gold was flat. And the Australian dollar fell some more to 72.5 US cents. Now, East Coast petrol prices are now at a record high, above $2 a litre, but you knew that already, probably. The tight oil market is not the only thing pushing up the prices of things we have to buy and leading to an inflation shock. There's also wheat, cattle, canola, cotton, soybeans and corn. And that's finance.